In this first video on ratio and proportion, we're going to look at how we write a ratio out. So first of all, when quantities are mixed together, it is often convenient to give the proportion or the ratio of each quantity. For example, to make a shade of green, you, may, you might want to mix two tins of yellow with three tins of blue. We would say the ratio of yellow to blue is two to three. And we'd write the ratio as yellow to blue is two to three. We can also flip that round and think about the ratio of blue to yellow, and that will get written like this. Blue to yellow is 3 to 2. In this worked example, we've got a collection of shapes of different colour, and we're going to write the ratio of a few of the different properties we can see. So the first one I've been asked to do is to look at the ratio of triangles to squares. So the first thing I need to do is to spot all the triangles. I can see I've got one, two, three, four, five, six triangles. So I'm going to ratio of triangles is six to two. And I need to count the number of squares. One, two, three, four. And we're going to do nothing else other than that just now. Our next video, we'll have a look at a little thing we can do with that ratio of six to four. Now, the next bit actually asks us to find the ratio of squares to triangles. So we don't need to count again because it's the same as this one here. We're going to flip it around. And I know I've got four squares. So the ratio of squares to triangles is four to six. And this third example we're going to look at now, it's to do with colour rather than the shapes. So I need to count how many red shapes do I have? One, two, three. I've got three red shapes and the ratio to blue is one, two, three, four. The ratio of red to blue is three to four. What I would like you to do now is is do the next thing here on your turn. So in your jotta, just answer those questions. Pause the video, and then when you've got your answers, unpause the video, and I'll show you the solution. Okay, let's have a look at this one here. And so half the squares, this is the answer to your turn, and you can see how you've got on in your jotta. So hearts to squares. So I'm going to count the number of hearts first of all. One, two, three, four. So I can write down there are four hearts, and the ratio of the squares is one, two, three, four, five, six. And just like in the worked example, it's squares to hearts. Now I can flip it round, it becomes six to four. And the final one is the ratio of the yellow shapes to the red shapes. And I can see I've got one, two, three yellow shapes to one, two, three, four red shapes. So the ratio of yellow to red is three to four. You can now go back to um, the practice exercise and carry out those questions.